60 Second Science. Okay guys, we're gonna start off with a demonstration today. First of what you'll need is a tea bag, yes, uh, and some scissors. Scissors are really cool for this. And you'll need some tin foil. Look at that aluminum foil. That's such a beautiful piece of aluminum foil. Oh my God. My favorite is fire. My personal favorite. I love fire so much. Look at this fire. It's beautiful. So what we're gonna do first is cut the top of the tea bag and the tag on top of the tea bag off. Remove that and uh, we can cast that off to the side here. You want to open up the top of the tea bag and pour the contents of the tea bag, which is the tea leaves, into something. It could be like this little plastic container right here. That works pretty well. Then what you want to do is cut the bottom portion of the tea bag off. And what you want to turn this tea bag into is a cylindrical shape. And it, as you can see here, this tea bag looks a little bit like a cylinder. And that's very important for making sure that this experiment works correctly. You also want to make sure that you put the tea bag on top of a non flammable surface. Tin foil or aluminum foil works pretty well for this. It's usually pretty commonly found in most households. So I decided to go with that. Now, enough with the talking, let's light this baby on fire. Let's get started. And uh, here we go. And. Uh, Oh, you know what? It might be better if I turn off the lights first so you can see this flaming bag of tea lift up. And here we go. It's rising in the air. It's on fire. It's on fire. It's on fire. It's rising. It's rising high. Oh my god, that was so cool. So now is a good time to explain that this works because of a force called convection, which is just the transfer of heat from one place to another. Because the top of the tea bag is heated up rapidly, the hot air badly wants to rise. So much so that it pushes the lightweight tea bag up against the force of gravity. Make sure you like and subscribe.